charge Read up my name all over the stars Pull up in the ship, there's nowhere to park You wanna come, don't know who you are Go where you are, we try and go Why you lying, face so cold, sun set on the horizon Play this game like a plan what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Yawn from The Common Hype and today we are at Kobe Swap Meet located here in San Diego, California and I'm super excited about it because if you guys are new to the channel, every single Kobe Swap Meet video that we do not only blows up but you guys just love these videos and we love being here. It's right around the corner from Arizona and there's so many shoes here, there's so many vintage and it's just an exciting event. If you guys are watching this video right now, be sure to like this video, comment down below because we respond to every single comment and we give $25 cash app to a random commenter and subscribe to the channel if this video hits 10,000 likes we are giving away a pair of the cool gray 11s that just released today in your size so if you are a lady and you wear a 327y we got you if you're a guy and you wear 8 through 14 maybe 15 I guess 16 for the big feet guys I don't know we will get you hooked up with a pair of cool gray 11 so 10,000 likes drop a comment and it's gonna be a fun time uh, we are here with the man the myth the legend AP who's Got the hotcakes themselves on AP. Something a little light today. N you nothing a, too crazy. You got a big foot. It's size 12. Jeez. I know. I heard you mention about the $25 cash app. Uh -huh. I think we should up the ante a little bit for this wow. video. Wow. Let's give away hundred bucks. Okay, are we gonna do four separate winners or are we gonna do? Yeah, let's do four separate winners. Okay, oh, I like that. Gives yeah. you guys more of a chance. Yeah. All right, four separate winners, hundred bucks total. And we'll, right. so we'll send the cash app directly to you. I'm excited for it today. Yeah, I know. I get so excited. Fun. It's the only outdoor event that I know of, really. And it's the largest one That's right. in the nation. And he can mark it, let me tell you. <laughs> All the big guys are here right now. Yeah, I know. Today should be a lot of fun. We've got 15 acres over this 40-acre parking lot full of 600 booths. Probably 300 of them are dedicated to sneakers or vintage clothing. Probably at least 10,000 pairs, a couple million dollars worth of inventory. Every influencer in the game's out here. But most important, Common Hype made the way out here from AZ, we so did. I appreciate you guys so much. Thanks for having us, we, this is our favorite event. We, we get amped up for this event, so much so that uh, we bust out the fits. And by bust out the fits, I mean I busted out my cozy fit today. <laughs> so we'll start with myself. I got the vintage Nike crew neck. I've got the Essentials uh, track sweatpants. And then I wore the Sakai's today because this is exactly the event that I found my size in this colorway at the last Kobe Swap Meet event. So yeah, wow, good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. AP, let's get your fit check, yes, all right? Sir. Gotta rock Kobe's all the way. So we got the Kobe's puff hoodie, Kobe's track pants, the Nike Ooh. track pants, and then the 75th anniversary Chicago Dunks, and then the Kobe side bag. So, and the Kobe's yeah. hat. Exactly, Kobe's hat, and then a little a little LV love on that's there, a little that's design. That's a real walking billboard. Right? So, that's just yeah. something slight for him. Yeah. Exactly, something slight on the wrist. So, yeah. yeah. No big deal. <laughs> He's very subtle with it. He won't show it unless he gets the fit check. All right, Drew. All right. Oh. Drew, oh, really? come out. Oh, wow. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Background just waiting. Okay. Started up top, I got the black hat, just fresh off the press, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I got the crew neck on, talentless sweats, and then you guys see them, the golden rods, unreleased. They released in Europe. Yeah, they did. But you got them here but in the US. But I have them, and I already right. wore them out, so yeah, they're a little dirty. Yeah, you did. All right. You guys can use the receiver name link down below to clean your shoes. Uh, shout out to Drew, by the way. I left the shoes I was going to wear here at home. I don't know how I ended up doing that, but I did, so Drew helped me out. Got me right with the piggies today, my neutral braids. They actually used to be mine, so, you know, they came back home for the day. How the um, turntables. Yeah, how the turntables. Funny how it works, huh? Uh, brown corduroy pants, Kith box logo hoodie. Nothing crazy today. Very simple. Leave a like for my boy. Oh, Three right. videos a week. Drop it. Sheesh. Back to back to back to back to back to back bangers. Yeah, he oh gets my it. Gosh. Let's get to cash now. You guys saw last video, a couple videos ago. We got these early. A couple Good Chef members are picking it up. We are restocking in this video. Very subtle. All right. Good Chefs, you guys know all about it. I promoted it heavily and I will continue to do so. If they want the early pairs. They know where to come. Uh, link in the description down below to purchase a membership. You can cancel at any time and uh, you get access to early pairs like this. Investment from, advice from myself. Kind of the plays that I personally do and uh, we made a lot of stuff you guys saw the mochas you saw the starfish at low investments that we're up money on a lot of money on right now good chefs gets all that stuff earlier so they're able to buy pairs before I even announce that stuff on YouTube so uh, restock down below in the description if you guys do want to join but uh, I'm excited to cash out some shoes there's some good stuff here and we need to start at the front Bryce let's go all right Drew today we're on the lookout okay. for cool gray 11s yep. we need the light smoke gray mids really we need bread to lows what about some more mochas um we're, we are deep, but we could use we more. Back we could use more. Right? I'm good on Oreos. And then we also, we need to find some used, some good used ones Ooh. too. And then later on, we will go personal vintage shopping. Really? And then on the we, company card, right? Yeah. Uh, dude, we should uh, turn the camera around yeah. here, right here, Brian. Because these guys got pairs. Let's see if we can, I really want all the smoke rays. So I just got to figure out a price. So let's see what we can do. Hey, man, can I get on YouTube Appreciate you, bro. Too? Thank you. Thank you. I watch you guys every day, man. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. Good looks. Anything like you want to tell the YouTube? 
Nothing really, man. We came all the way from Fresno. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, that's a, I heard you guys from uh, what? Um, He's from Bay Area. Bay Area. Bay Area? Yeah. Okay. What's going on, man? How you doing? Good? Little Good? man, a little, a little, do a little shopping, man. Absolutely, so. bro. Appreciate you watching the channel, man. Have a good one, guys. Long time no see. How you been? Chilling, bro. Same old. I need to know how much you're asking for your light smoke grays. Those ones are his. So okay. he has like, I think he has 60, and then I just have this little pack right here. Oh, uh, how much are you asking for? Yeah, 10 and a half, 10 and a half, 11, 11 and a half, 12. Like 250 take all. Okay. And then what about if I take your five and a half through like 10? I don't want to be stuck. You, yeah. yeah, you want to split them? I mean, I can take all. That's not a big deal. 250 take all is just. It's tough. I mean, I can pay it on like the smaller sizes, but the bigger sizes just, no, they don't go for me. Yeah. Or if you want to break it down by the- I mean, we could, yeah, we could break it down. I'd like to be at essentially 10 under ask. What is that for the five and a half? Route? So the five and a half is 220, it'd be like 210. The good money ones, seven through nine and a half, that's going to be at like anywhere from 240 to 260 to 280. And then the bigger sizes, it's like 190. 10 under. My guy's got heat, by the way. Let me just appreciate all this. 2860 is, I think, what an average too. I bought it early too. <laughs> I love holding. You're a big holding? Short term. Good, good, good. I Short like that. Term. If it hits my person, no, no, no. Yeah. Good. If you guys didn't hear him, he likes to, uh, he likes to hold, but he likes to quick holds, yeah. which is good. If you guys are new to the reselling game or, you know. Bread toes, love Bread toes. Particle gray, man. It's all, it's all the stuff that we do and we quick hold. And then once we hit our margin for it, it's gone. We're in and out and then we're back into the next one. Howdy, sir. What are your, what's your uh, sizes on these? Firm 250 of every size. Oh my, even if I take all? 240. <sighs> hey, I sold, I sold 12, it got sold for 250. This is Kobe swap meet, yeah. right? Don't you disrespect them like that. <laughs> hey, right? Kobe's is the, is the best, bro. Oh, all sleep right. sleep on Kobe's. My boy's firm. All right, thank you though, I appreciate it. My man, how are we doing today? I brought your favorite shoe. You're really trying to break my bank today, huh? Yeah. Um, all right, size nine, Desert Moss. How much are you looking for? Brand new, right? 350. 350? Yeah. Okay, let me check. I'll buy Converse used. I'm okay on the Converse. These are used or worn? Or uh, new? Used, me and offer. Uh, 320? 340. I'll meet you in the middle at 330 and we can do it. Do it. Okay, awesome. Vic, can you be my legit checking guy, double check, and just make sure both pairs same size and everything while I buy? Listen, these have shot up ever since our man Virgil died. How much? Just out of curiosity, I don't know if I'm buying this, Bri, but. I'm looking for six, bro. Yeah, you can get Don't six. Offer, and stuff like this, like I would love to have it, but I need the market to kind of settle yeah. um, with everything, because yeah. it's really peaked out right now, so I'd right, like to not buy at the peak, but these are gas. And you're getting really happy about showing them to me. <laughs> but I will pass on these, and then. Uh, really? Yeah. You want to let me hold a dollar, G? Uh, Amaz, how much? I'm at 420 with those. 420 on these? And are you firm on that? I know market tanked a little bit. Yeah. And I think it's like 380-ish right now on the nine and a half. However, I'm gonna have to pass on this one because this one's a nine and a half and this one's a 10 and a half. I'm sure. Look, the left shoe's a 10 and a half and then this shoe on the right is a nine and a half. Cool, got him from this guy. Okay, all right, go back, all right, okay. go back. You. Yep, no worries. He's probably freaking out right now too. Thank God you spotted that before. Hey, hey, you know, I'm always looking out, okay. you know what I mean? Appreciate you. The one? Yeah, I do, yeah, yeah. Just about bringing back with the right size. I'm good on these, I'm good on these, and I'm good on these. Okay, cool. So just 330 on the Desert Moss? Cool. Awesome, man. What do you think of these? I like them. Good. That's what I think, too. <laughs> I think the ladies are going to like these. These nature things are so weird. The recyclable Wait, stuff. Why haven't we bought the nature black and whites? Because they look the exact same. I'm going to buy the St. John look-alike ones. You see the... Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, well, yeah. Why not the black and white? They're pretty low. Because I just... I don't know why people are just iffy on it. Based on our feedback, at least. So that's what I'm going to try to stay away from them. This is a woman's pair. Six and a half. Okay. Possibly these. How much are you out on the Starfish? 130. Would you be able to do 115 on these? That's fine. 126 and a half Y. And then, what are these called? Bronze something? Bronze, Bronze Eclipse. Nine and an eight W. How much are we looking for on these? 160. These, I'd probably be a little what far off. Right, what would you be at? Um, I'd like to be on these at 130. Like 140. I could do it on the eight. I would have to be at 130 on the nine though. I'll just, you'll do the eight. Then. Eight, cool. Yeah. Sounds good. And then let me grab you some cash. This is what happens when you can't move cool gray 11s. You come to, you come to meet us all, you know? Size 13 too. Wow, Soul. How much? What you want to pay? <laughs> what do I want to pay? Five dollars is what I want to pay. What do you want to sell it for? So coin flip. Four? Three hundred, four hundred? <laughs> what you buying them for? Hold on. What you buying them for first? Right now? <laughs> oh <laughs> my here, god. <laughs> <laughs> like 280 to three? So look, three? Four hundred coin flip? I do 270 or 370 coin flip is what I do. <laughs> nah, I'm, I need these. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, he's going for you five. <laughs>
Do you see these yet? Give Papa Q's reaction because he does not like dunks. No, these are fire. Wow, that wait. They don't like dunks. I say it again. Like, these are fire. Is it because is it because we want Union to send anyone? Is that why? Union. <laughs> Put me on the friends and family list. <laughs> nah, these are pretty cool. I feel like somebody's gonna like cut them up to see the underlayer, even though they're probably using one. Cut them up tomorrow. I like it. This looks like it's like a kind of like a mirror metallic thing. It kind of looks 3M. I don't know if it is, yeah, but it then look how like the on the ends. Oh yeah, stitching. so these are definitely made to be like taken apart. Yeah, these are sick. Ooh, I like that. And too. the green the touch. Hey, which hat should I pick today? One could have a mystery pair of socks. Bro, your socks are so comfy, by the way. Oh, Every yeah. time I ball, I wear them. Yeah, the Dream like Crew stand socks? Funky, yeah. Because they're so thick. They just send me a new sponsor us? Yeah. Yeah, here, I'll take them off my feet. <laughs> Congrats, who I am? Holy <laughs> Congrats on the star, bro. Congrats. I'm, 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 dude, I know, I saw that. I'm very sorry to hear that. I'm very sorry to hear that. Professionals, eight people, gloves on. Hit that run in three minutes. Him and I have been doing a business for a while. Four years ago? Four, yeah, four years, four years ago. ago. Yeah, ago. we've been doing Chinese. stuff through WeChat. When the Chinese, when the Chinese market, market was fire, bro, yeah. yes. He actually opened a store here in California and they actually got looted, unfortunately. So, I'm um, sorry to hear. You bounce back. You bounce, you bounce back. back. I know you do, you work hard, bro. I'm sorry to hear about that again, man. That sucks, right. yeah. But you're killing it, bro. I know you'll get, you got it, bro. I'm gonna swing back around, though, for some of your stuff. Very nice, nice to see you. Nice, nice to officially meet you, bro. Nice to see you, brother. All right, so we just picked a bunch of personals, some cheap stuff. Look, this is Bry's bag. My bag, okay? Just just take that in. My bag. What's your best? Say again? What's your best on these? I'd be closer to two. I do 225. I do 210. 210? Cool. Got that deal. Cool. How we doing, bro? Bro, big fan, man. Nice to meet you. Appreciate that. I saw a resale because of you. Really? I swear. Yeah, bro. Shave my head because of him. <laughs> Wow! Cool. You too, bro. Let's I appreciate go. that. How's the reselling journey going for you? Uh, it's kind of rough. It's kind of hard out here, man. It's really? My first event. Okay. And it looks like you have cash, so that's uh, good. I, I brought cash. Basically, cash here today. Gotcha. Okay. This is your side. Did you watch the channel? Of course. Yeah. That, oh, I got these because of you guys. Good. You're already up, huh? Yeah. How much did you pay? Retail. Oh my gosh. Good. Get in on that one. I, I and you're already up. And I was like, wait. I was watching you guys' video. I was like, bro, I just really, my friend passed upon these. I'm like, are you sure? He's like, all right. Sign me the pair then. His yeah. friend passed on him and slid him to him. Tell your friend he fumbled to, the bag. Yeah, oh, tell your friend no, he, he fumbled he it. Up. He was mad after. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, not my fault. Price today is not the same as the price tomorrow. Where are you guys looking at? Uh, Arizona. Yeah. Right. Oh, sorry. Over there. <laughs> he knows where that thing is. My bad. You have a YouTube, right? That's right. How's it going? Yeah. Say what's okay. up to him. Uh, up? Picked up Cool Grace, size 10 and 10 and a half for 280 a pop. Got him. Yeah. Got him. I like it. There we go. You and some 11s, Bri? I mean, you could rock it, dude. I don't know. I, Tell, ask the comments if I need Cool Grace for um, the tilt. I think Bri could rock them for sure. Both of them are brand new, yeah? Yeah. Must be nice to get exclusive access. I actually hit for retail this morning. Yeah. I yeah. Got, I got Six and a half and a nine. I got you, nice. What's 280, 285, 60? Yes, sir. Appreciate you, bro. No Thank worries, you, bro. no worries. Thank you very much. I'm gonna look around too and see if you have some more stuff. Yeah, these have been, these have seen better today. Yeah. yeah, it's such a fire shoe. I got Bryson these for a Christmas gift no, <coughs> back in the day. when I was 16. Birthday when he was 16, I paid, I think I paid 360 for him back in the day. And I appreciate that, bro. Thank you. Thank you, bro, I appreciate you. Are you firm on these? Yeah, okay. probably five is the lowest, but it does have a, I'll show you the flaw. Yeah, that, I saw that too. But Appreciate the honesty. Yeah. Um, Amaz, what are your sizes? That is a size nine. And how much are you looking for? My four, but you bought for me already. I can 360. Would you run me 350? Let's do it. Let's run cool. it. Let's cool. run it. My boy. Yeah, got him. Got him. Got, got, got him kicks. Got him. I know you're at 270 for these, but would you do two? Sure. I'd have to be for my two in order to take them. Just because I'm, to be honest with you, I'll probably only sell them for like 280, which is what you're trying to sell for. But. <laughs> My guy, I appreciate you. Can I see the other shoe too, if you don't mind? We'll grab these for two. We'll probably sell these for 280-ish. So, um, are these yours now? Yeah, they have all these shimmers and then foam. Are you firm on these? Uh, no. What's the best you could do? They took all three. Yeah, I know they went up a little bit. Yeah, they did, bro. It's crazy. That the 8W is actually at 380. That's nuts. Um, I mean, I uh, the nine would have to be a three. The eight and eight and a half, or the eight and a half is a little lower. Or no, these are two eights. Yeah. Two eights, I'd be at. 330. Can you do 310 on the nine? And then um, how much should you say on these? 330. I'll do 340 and 310. I'll do 310 and then 330. That would be my best. That'd be our best? Yeah. All right, you're taking all three. I'll do that. Cool. What else you got? Do you do 280 on this? 290. Yeah, that's fine. Cool. Okay, so these three, yeah, that's it. All right, cool. 
I'll run that. Awesome. Thank you, Brent. I'll get some boxes for you. Steals. Appreciate you. Some retail steals? Oh, uh, you would have to give me 220 to take those. <laughs> <laughs> that bag is fire, though, bro. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. Um, who's mummies? And what are we thinking? Offer. One dollar. Yeah, offer. Don't tell me to offer. 550. I think I. Yes. I'd be okay in these. Yeah, cool. How much? Oh, 220. Man, it's not my friend. I'm only my friend. I'm just going. Can you me out. can you tell your friend we don't even sell them for that much? Yeah. Just going cash me out. One forty. <laughs> in store, you got a store? Yeah. Where at? In the Plaza Bonita. How old are you? I'm fourteen. Hey. Get that handshake again. <laughs> yeah. Sheesh. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa! You hiring? Yeah. <laughs> you need a cameraman. You, you, sh you show me a pay stub for seventy thousand dollars. I quit my job and I work for you. I do one sixty, and That's then we can. Pay. Oh, okay, so 170. I'm making ten dollars. <laughs> That's good. You don't have to bring it back to your store. Fine, I'll do it. Just for the camera. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Hey. Yeah. Good looks, bro. Appreciate you. All right, so we got the little man landing here. How old are you? Uh, nine. Nine years old. You watch the channel? Yeah. And do you sell shoes too? Yeah, I sell a little bit. A little bit? All right. What do you want? Do you want to be like a shoe seller when you grow up, or? Yeah, I want to be a reseller. You want to be a reseller? Um, Try to resell a lot of shoes and try to be like you guys. That's awesome, man. And what grade are you in? Uh, fourth. Fourth? Hey, fourth grade, nine years old, and he wants to be a reseller. He wants to sell shoes. Well, thank you for the support. He got a hat. We're going to throw in a pair of common hype socks for you. Yeah, of course, man. It's funny. I don't even have those socks yet. Yeah, we just got them, and I don't even have a personal pair yet. So you're like the second person to get them? It's pretty good. We met him and his pops, uh, where were we at last time? Secret Con Phoenix, yeah. Thank you again for the support, man. Thanks for watching the channel. Anything you want to tell them? Start young. Start young? A little grinder right here. Thanks again, man, and nice to meet you. Thanks, man. We got uh, dead stuff. Okay. I'm good on this colorway. That's it? Yes. Okay, so we agreed on 280, 280. for a size 9 cool gray. The panda, how much you at? I could do 280 on those as well. Would you be able to do 260 on these? I'd be firm at 280. Firm at 280? I just have so many of these. For sure. But uh, I'll take another one. That's fine. I'll, I'll do 280. Um, these worn ones? Yeah, what's your offer on those? I'm not too sure. I've only used them once. I don't pay incredibly well yeah. on uh, used pairs, I'll be honest. Do you have any price in mind? Can you do 280? Um, no, because I'd probably only sell them for like 320. Okay. So I gotta make a little bit more money. Um, okay, that's fine. Gray Fogs, size nine is going for uh, 270 right now. You paid pretty high on those, so if anything, I'll probably hold off on those as well. Okay, um, I'd offer you 250. Gotcha. Okay, so 280, 280, and then these gems right here. Lot one, size 10, it's Bryson size. How much are you looking for on these? We're just gonna buy them right now, and then I'll think about it later. Can you do a market on those? No? I gotta make some money on them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and if I'm spending a thousand or a thousand plus, I gotta make a little bit of money on them. They're kind of all over the place. Twelve thirty, lowest at like eleven fifty. Can't do twelve. No, I could do. I could do eleven. All right, we could do that. Eleven? Yes, sir. You guys got a deal. Thank you. All right, so two eighty, two eighty, and eleven hundred. Yes. Uh, do you have the sneakers receipt for this on your phone somewhere? Yeah. Smells like it's about to go on the piggies. No, no. It smells good. It doesn't really smell eleven hundred good. But. All right, we got Big Bo in the house. You know, our boy Bo. I miss him so much. We haven't seen him in forever. Oh, Bo, we will we'll be yeah. together soon. Yeah, yeah. He'll be he'll be in Arizona again soon. All right. Uh, What's good, bro? How you doing? Hey, bro. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. Keep yes, it up, sir. Man. Thanks, Bo. Yeah, thank you, bro. Drew the new cameraman, by the way. Today. He's been doing pretty good on the camera. He though, does in real nice on the camera. Yeah, good looking zooms. Have you been teaching him some tricks? I have. Can you tell he's really fluent with the camera? Yeah. I wish you could go low ball with us. That would be fun. Oh, let me just let me just make a couple calls. Walk around with us when we go do our personal run. Okay. For personal. Yeah, I'll drip you out, son. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, I need your pants plug. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you're not getting it. <laughs> I need it first. Oh my god. They just called in. I'm not. I can't make this shit up. Let's call the announcement. Brandon Michael Yamamoto. We found your ID. Really, Brandon? Well, you need your ID to get on the flight later. So I'm glad someone found it and returned it. So I just went up to grab his ID, and whoever returned the ID and cards stole the wallet but they gave him his cards and his ID back and stole the wallet, so thanks for the cards back, I guess. I don't know. I mean, I'm glad he got all this stuff back. He needs his ID to get on this flight later, but what's the point of stealing the wallet? But I mean, that. I think we've talked about it on the channel before. Brandon's ran through like four or five green Goyard wallets. Bro, how do you feel about losing your fourth Goyard wallet? I feel like I didn't even think I brought my wallet here. I thought it was at the hotel. Uh, we lucked out there. Shout out to the whoever brought 
all the cards back. Whoever brought the cards back stole your wallet, so not shout out to you, but I mean, I guess thanks I mean, for bringing it back. Unless they wrote down all the card info. I would just cancel all those, to be honest. Oh my, get you. Oh my god. They're not all mine, they're not all mine. Get, get him on his, his pair. Where, where, where? Yeah, get mine, get, these are my pair. <laughs> they don't want that One, two, three. Are you building a house? <laughs> hey, I'm here to do Cause that's a lot of bricks, bro. <laughs> oh no, I'm dead. Are these yours? That's my friend. What, he wants three? He wants 300. Yeah. Good shit. Alright, I'm gonna go get the next guy. Good yes, to see you, bro. Sir. How much you got on your men's starfish? Uh, I'm asking 240. Could you do better if I took all of them? I'd probably be like at uh, 225, honestly. I'd rather just hold them. Okay, no worries, bro. Thank you. Yeah, no All right, well, as you guys can see, we're trying to get some lowballing in on these tables. Um, not even lowballing, I'm just trying to get some pairs for market or even under market. It's just not really happening right now. I think we've already scoped out some of the better deals, and most of the people that are willing to sell for lower are just coming right up to the table and selling there. So um, I don't think there's going to be lowballing in this video, unfortunately. Um, there's just not much we can do about it. It's kind of hard. Everyone's run the intro anyway. Yeah, I'm going to run the intro for the good time's sake, but uh, we're just going to go shopping for some personals right now. So uh, to replace the lowballing, sorry I didn't today, but you guys know we'll be in New York tomorrow, so we'll make it happen there. All right, so a little mid-break here. Kobe's, another incredible event. Of course, I'm getting a call right when we have to film. Quick little break in the action. Kobe's has been an amazing event as always. West Coast, San Diego, LA, the whole state of California, they always show love. Uh, something I want to touch base on though, Bri, the state of sneakers, right? Nike made a few announcements about how they were delaying shipments to basically all of their uh, Nike account stores that they have, all the tier zero, tier one, tier two, three accounts. The way we're buying right now, I think it's kind of interesting to see what the sneaker market's gonna hold within the next eight months. I know JC from UM was talking about how it's just gonna be incredibly difficult to, to get shoes. And even the release this morning, the Cool Gray 11s, Dude. there was, first of all, the first foot- First of all, this dude hit. I did, two pairs, size nine and six and a half. I couldn't even get mad though, because I hit that restock a couple weeks ago. That's right, I hit four pairs, that's right. I was pretty upset. I wanted one for the toe. I was able to easily hit off sneakers. I think there was only like 100,000 pairs on sneakers um and there was obviously exclusive access weeks prior to but and they dropped so many pairs they dropped on so many access, pairs so we thought they're gonna drop pairs on sneakers today because there's supposed to be so many of them so it's funny because we had cool grape 11 pairs early for the longest time they're still right now buy now after fees maybe give or take plus 20 to 30 bucks but that's obviously the convenience fee of they're having actually them. up today now they're up even more today because people struck out this morning i think there was no foot site release online um, it was only in stores via raffles and such and then the sneakers app and that's really the only places people were able to get pairs Dick's Sporting Goods and that's really about it. So the market spiked up and now big sizes are lowest ass is like 250 which justifies the price that we're selling for and everybody was commenting on Instagram bro just blowing Wait, us big up. big sizes are at what? 250 right now lowest ask. No bro they're way more than that. They could be more than I mean I just tried to buy sorry. a size 12. You're right. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I was yeah, sorry, sorry, I sorry. tried to buy a size 12 market. because retail's 220. That that's my fault. Yeah. That's on me. But yeah, no, people are commenting on Instagram like, bro, just wait till the million pairs release. Everybody's yeah. going to be able to hit <laughs> so easily for retail and guess what happened? Um, so this is the first example of a shoe coming out, a highly sought out after shoe that was incredibly difficult to get. And I think, I mean, there hasn't been really any dunk, new dunk releases re recently. It's similar to what happened with the Jubilees, right? Right. Except minus how many early pairs there were. There weren't that many early pairs of Jubilees. But, but Jubilee started. Jubilee started low and they, I mean, now today they've climbed and people held onto them stuff. I think a lot of people are going to hold on to their cool grays. Um, and the people that want to quick sell are going to quick sell. Um, and they'll make their money too though. It's just kind of up to us. So we didn't really know what we were going to do. We are going to send a bunch of pairs out because you guys know we send out pairs to consignment in different places. But I don't know. I think now it would make sense to hold them ourselves. And you know, I, I know you like yeah. to rinse and repeat, buy in and out, but it's kind of hard to really predict what the market's going to do. I think it's just going to keep going up. It's a good shoe. It's a classic shoe. It's a cool gray. It's an OG colorway. Um, so there's variables like that you have to think of. But just in general, getting shoes in the next year, it's going to be difficult. and. I don't know. I think prices are going to jump, but I don't know how willing people are going to be to pay the prices of the high tickets that are going to Yeah, happen. and I'll be honest. Johnson and I, our plan was to get rid of as, as many shoes as possible before December 31st and really be very particular about what we buy. Now the goal is completely yeah. changed. It's completely shifted. Now the goal for Bryce and I is to buy as many pairs as possible because you can't find pairs anymore. And all these resale boutiques, all your local sneaker shops um, that are not foot lockers and such like that, um, stores like us, Common Hype, we're going to thrive. And that's just because people are going to have such a hard time finding shoes because there's none available. And there's going to be comments already. I can already see them. You guys are the reason we can't get shoes for retail, blah, yeah, blah, blah. Like, right. you don't understand. Like, 
I understand where you're coming from in the sense of the resale game, but you have to adapt to what's happening. Like nothing's the same. Things that were happening 15 years ago may or may not be happening today. Like everything changes, you have to adjust to what's happening. And if you sit there and complain about it, you'll get you know you'll get it off your chest. But at the same time, you're not you're not going to get anywhere with that. So, us reselling shoes isn't the reason the sneaker game is killed. We do it and thousands, hundreds of thousands of other people do it too. Um, so you just gotta remember like, this is what we do for a living. This is how we teach you guys how to do it. We're teaching you guys. We're trying to give you guys the tools. We're not just flexing and you know, showing all this money, throwing it around. We genuinely wanna help you guys succeed in ways that you know, we didn't really have people to look up to. We had to figure it out ourselves. Um, and the people that did help us, you, know, you gotta pass on the knowledge and that's what we try and do for you guys. So as much as there's gonna be people that hate on us for you know, reselling and killing the game, you know, we're also trying to help you guys capitalize off what's happening and kind of give a better understanding of the inside of the game, you know, where a lot more things are happening on the business yeah. side of it. And that's stuff that we wanna teach you guys. So hopefully yeah. um, the people that do appreciate it, you guys are taking what we're telling you and we're really trying to help you guys. We gave you guys Archeo Pink calls, Burgundy Dunk calls, uh, Mocha Lowe's. Starfish. Starfish. Fire Red. Fire Red. Mocha Mocos. One. You guys can go back to our old videos and see we've been doing this for a long time. And that's kind of why the channel's grown to what it is. We want to help you guys out. So take it with a grain of salt, whatever you guys want to do with that information. But just know, you know, it's not malicious what we do. Reselling, it's just part of it. If we don't go and buy that shoe, someone else is going to. Someone else is going to flip it for money. So, you know, why not us? And we'll make, we'll lose money on it anyway. Yeah, that's you right. Know? Somehow, some way. We'll find a way. We could have said it better myself, Brad. Yeah, I just hey. had to get off my chest, man. Yeah. You know, you guys come after us sometimes. And I, I get it. It's, it's frustrating if, you know, you want to hit for retail. So does everyone else. But it's just not the way it is anymore. Right. You know? Yeah. I got to pay resale too. We pay resale for everything we buy you guys understand that we're supporting other resellers by buying their inventory that they hit for retail someone hits for retail but it's usually not ever us you know so we're paying resale too we get the frustration but you know you turn the negative situation into a positive situation turn it into a business you know flip it around a little bit so my man Johnny over here from hijack this is his own brand he actually blessed us with some of his uh, teas so huge shout out to him some wrap teas correct yeah wrap teas and you know this is my brand stuff hijack Hijack USA on Instagram. You can go follow us. We're gonna be doing monthly drops with the rap tees and then we're gonna be dropping stuff like this, like curated vintage pieces and stuff like that. But yeah, appreciate you guys. I appreciate love the love, bro. Thank, thank you, you very much. Up, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Appreciate that, guys. Thank you. So that's gonna wrap up the event today, guys. Again, thank you to Kobe's for always showing love and having an amazing event every single time that we come. We love this event. We love being on the West Coast. Love doing our trips to San Diego. And uh, yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drew, anything you want to say? Shout out to AP and everyone out here. Shout out to San Diego and uh, LA. Everyone that comes down and shows us so much love. It's always a great event. We're always happy to be here. We'll be here uh, again soon. Remember, we got Gatsol in the next video, and then uh, good chest free socks down in the description below it'll be live for a little bit in the next video too so i'll go into more detail in the latter in, in the later video another successful cash out video we really do hope you guys enjoy if you guys did be sure to like this video comment down below your favorite part because we are cash apping four random people 25 dollars each for ap said it so oh we're gonna do it gosh and I then uh, about that subscribe to the channel again if you have not already it just helps the youtube algorithm um, by you guys watching these videos and we're hoping you guys do to get some value out of it vic thank you for your help today anything you want to say mr rich man Join good chefs if you want cool like this. You heard the man. Well, hopefully you heard the man. I don't know if the mic got that far. Anyways, uh, from the whole team, thank you guys for tuning in. We'll see you guys in the next video.